Hello everybody, I'm Simon Fels from the Endbox Engineering team at Canonical and today I would like to show you how easy it is to stream an Android game title, in this case um, the game Beach Buggy Racing 2 from the company Vector Unit um, with Endbox Cloud. We will uh, use in this example um, like a, a G5G X large instance on um, the AWS cloud. Um, the instance is equipped with a Graviton 2 CPU and a NVIDIA T4 GPU, uh, which will be used for the rendering and the video encoding. So in the first step, what we have to do is we have to create the actual application. Um, we go and give it a name like BBR2 in this case, we select an Android image based on Android 13, uh, we select the resource type which is describing how many CPU cores, how much time on the GPU and how much memory um, the instances for this application get and then in the last step we have to select the actual Android application package and once we are ready to go, like we can go and create the application. Once the application is ready, we can actually create instances from it. We can just go and configure a few instance details. Um, for example, for Beach Buggy Racing, it's important to switch to landscape mode as the game uh, forces the user to switch to that. Uh, so we have to do it here as well. And then we can just go and create a new instance. And if, if you see, like I've created two others already, uh, so that we can also look at how um, you can have multiple instances running in parallel and stream from all of them. So the instance we have just created here is currently starting up. Um, that takes a short moment and once the state is being updated yeah, now it's switched to status running, we can actually just go in and stream it on our browser and we see here yeah, the game is loading. And we can now actually control the game with our key, uh, cursor, uh, keyboard, but we can also just click via the mouse and pick a character. We can pick um, a track. Let's pick this one here. Let's pick We Up For Chill today. And then we can actually start a race. An interesting detail, uh, which is always good to have a look in when you talk about cloud gaming and, and streaming, is to have an eye for like how does the network perform, how does the stream actually perform. So we provide extensive metrics in the UI for this, which give you details on how the frame rate fluctuation actually looks like. You see uh, that it's here fluctuating between 59 and 60 FPS. Um, you get details about how the bandwidth utilization is actually looking like, so we see quite um, yeah, well used bandwidth here for what we actually stream. And we also see like important details like, hey, do we have any lost packets? Like in this case for audio note, uh, for video also no lost packets, so that's uh, we are sitting on a healthy network. And then if we close all of that and we look at the other streams like we have going, like we can stream the other instances as well and you see like, oh, that's in a completely different uh, scenario right now and we can do the race and we can also um, very easily connect to multiple instances, multiple browser tabs. Yeah, and I have to say I'm not really the best racer. Um, so yeah, that's all I wanted to show today. Um, I hope this is of interest and let us know what you are doing with Sandbox Cloud.